Okay, so three, two, three. Three, yeah, three weeks ago, I posted a video on YouTube talking about one of my passive income streams, which was web hosting. And of course, if you haven't seen that video, definitely go check it out. I'll link it up here. Before you watch this one, it'll make a lot more sense, I promise. But to my surprise, that video kind of blew up and I, I kind of feel like a 14 year old girl when I say that, like, oh, my video on Instagram, it just blew up. So the video did really, really well, way better than I thought it would. And I, I thought that I answered the majority of the questions that I thought people were gonna have in the video, but there are a lot of other questions that I really didn't anticipate. I talked about how to find clients, how I accept payments, how to do this, how to do that, but there was still a ton that I didn't really answer. So again, if you haven't seen the video, go watch it here. Um, but if you're too lazy to do that, essentially what I talked about in the video is how I purchase a server, or not purchase, I rent a server for a flat rate every month. And then what I do is I host websites for a lot of other people on that one server that I rent. So my server costs about 25 bucks a month, but I have 43 different websites, 43 different clients that I host on this one server, and I charge them anywhere between 15 to $50 a month. So you can see that with just one client, I cover the cost of the server, and then all the other clients above and beyond that are money in my pocket. Essentially, this is just like having a rental property on the internet. Obviously, if you've seen any of the other videos on my channel, that's what I talk about almost exclusively, but it really is like having a rental property on the internet. The great thing though is you don't have to deal with tenants very often. You don't have to worry about collecting rent or getting late because it's just automated. You also don't have to worry about tenants destroying your place or flooding the place or dealing with a clogged toilet at two o'clock in the morning. Like I said, I currently have 43 different websites and they're pretty much anything and everything under the sun. I host websites for small businesses, medium businesses, um, a lot of mommy bloggers I have. Um, I've got a couple like weight loss blogs. Um, I've got an energy company. I've got two construction companies. I mean, I, it doesn't matter. Like, I don't care what the companies are. Anybody who needs a website or needs web hosting, I'm happy to handle it for them. Each and every month from every single one of these clients, I get a little paycheck. And all of those little paychecks together add up to about $700 a month. Initially, it was a decent amount of work to find the clients, get everything up and running. But once it's established and everything's done, it's so easy. Like when I say easy, I mean really easy. For the most part, I don't spend any more than 30 minutes a month managing all of my clients. Now that brings me to the point of this video. Why am I just reiterating everything that I said in that video? The reason is because I've built a playlist talking about my web hosting business and how to do it step by step by step. There are a lot of like little breakdowns and little kind of like minutia steps that I definitely missed just because it was a, you know, it was like a 20 minute video and there's no way to possibly answer all of the questions, all of the different steps that are involved uh, with owning a web hosting business. So uh, click the link down in the description below. And like I said, I have a playlist with step by step by step instructions on everything you need to know and everything you need to do to start your own web hosting business. So I think this is a really great idea because this isn't ever talked about. In the previous video, I talk about um, how if you go and look at like those blog posts about, you know, 20 ways to find passive income or, you know, whatever it may be, it's all just the same ideas over and over and over again. And I, on my channel, I try to do things that are a little bit different. So again, if that interests you, um, go ahead and click on the link in the description below and I'll see you in the next video.